Hi, my name is Gene Allen, and this little video is going to show you how to do a threshold block. Uh, in other words, we're going to allow, in this case, we're going to allow people to copy five files within 10 minutes, but we're not going to let them copy more than five files in 10 minutes. Um, this is pretty good if you want to stop block, uh, bulk copies, sorry. So we're going to create a nice rule. Block access, block bulk copies. And we want to block write, create, rename. And we want to write for all files. We want it to be for all users everywhere. We're going to keep servers checked here because this is a demo machine. I'm running the server application. But typically, you just have workstations. And program name filters, we're only going to block, um, we're going to block Windows Explorer since that's the way most people copy files. But since Windows Explorer is written by Microsoft, they have a way of getting around it if it's blocked. And they try really hard to copy files. So they fall back onto something called DLL, DLL host. So we're going to block that too. So this rule is going to block writes, creates, and renames for all users, for all files, if they're written by Explorer or DLL host. All right, that's all there. Oh, let me turn on threshold. Here it is right here. Apply this rule after this threshold has been reached. Now we want it to be um, after five files within 10 minutes. So a more realistic thing would probably be, you know, 100 files in you know two hours or something, or 10 files in two hours, or whatever you want to do. But for my demo, I'm going to use five files within 10 minutes. So we should be able to copy five files and then start getting a whole bunch of blocks. This is because we check servers. Uh, typically, that won't be the case. So we're going to turn the rule on. Yes. Now we're going to come over here to Windows Explorer. And I got some files here in the temp folder. And let's just create and pick some. Here's, let's pick 10, 10 files. And we say copy. We come to this folder and we say paste. So you need to create it, do it. And then it starts saying, I can't do that. Try it again, try it again, try it again, can't do it. Okay, skip it. And as you can see, one, two, three, four, five files. And everything else is blocked. And that's all there is to it.